Welcome back. I'm Tiffany from A Century Too Late. Uh, today we'll be making rabbit pelt mittens. So this is the rabbit pelt that I use. Um, you can use fake fur if you prefer. Um, I got this from five of these on Amazon for like 25 bucks. Um, first off, all you do is just put your hand on a piece of paper, trace your hand, give about a quarter inch allowance seam. Uh, these are for my granddaughter. So one pelt for her, because she's little, uh, will make a pair of mittens. Unfortunately for an adult, one of these would make just one mitten, so you'd need two pelts. Um, I went ahead and cut mine out. Also, for these, I like giving the rabbit a haircut around here so you can see what you're cutting. Um, looks like I missed a little bit. Also, beware when you're doing this that the hair goes everywhere. So, just you know, know that this is a messy project. Um, so you can either have them with the fur on the outside or as you say leather on the outside. Um, I prefer the leather on the outside for my granddaughter just because this is so soft and she'll really enjoy this. So now that these are cut out and like I said I gave the rabbit a haircut and there's rabbit hair everywhere. I'm going to go ahead and sew these together. You do not have to um, have any kind of special sewing machine. They, you know, just use, you can even hand sew these if you prefer. Um, for me, it's just quick and easy and, and uh, I can just sew them quickly. So let's sew one of them and then we will turn it inside out and sew the next one. And I always backstitch just to make sure that, you know, there is a sturdy stitch at the end. And you can go as fast or as slow as you need. You don't need to, you know, keep up with me or, or anyone else. Do it at your own speed. one done and then we just want to turn them inside out or right side out or however you want to say it and don't worry about being easy it's not gonna rip Normally I have a chopstick that helps with the uh, getting these little pieces out, but sometimes you can just find a pen or something, stick it in there, and it works just as well. And you 
just want to get out all the little creases and everything and So there you go, there's one little mitten for her, and then you just fold the cuffs if you want, and you have her mitten. Well, I hope that everyone enjoyed this video, and I hope you come back soon.